Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So Thanks so much for that very friendly uh, reception. But I tell you, it's been a very intense week. This is a very intense week in Seattle. We're in the midst of the uh, NBA playoffs. There's a lot of trash talking going on. As you remember, after the first game, Shaquille O'Neal, the center for the Lakers, said that Coach George Carl, he coaches like a woman. He's coaching like a woman! Coach Carl said nothing at the time. Then several hours later, he said, what, what did you mean earlier when you listened? <laughs> what, what did, what do you mean by that? Day after the uh, game, the Lakers went to a strip club up on Lake City Way, and Shaq, still talking trash, talking, he yelled at the stage, You're dancing like George Carl! You did! <laughs> anyway, it was reported in Jean Godden's column, and I'm sure she's got the pipeline right up to, you know, the strip club, that the, uh, the Lakers spent $2,000 on table dances. You know, Shaq got all the way back to his car before he noticed that two of the dancers were still on his lap, finishing a couch dance. It's a, it's a big lap. Big lap. Kind of an intense week for Bill Gates. Bill Gates got some bad news this week. He lost $7 billion this week. Yes, I know. I know we all feel bad about it. Just, I want to put that in perspective. That would be like me handing the McDonald's drive through window $5 for the Big Mac combo and then driving off without waiting for my change. That would sort of be the same thing. Be like... Seven billion dollars. You know, guys are passing them in the hall at Microsoft. They're like, Bill, we're going up for a Mexican. You want to you go to lunch with us? Nah, I lost seven billion dollars. I should probably eat in the cafeteria, you know? <laughs> probably should do that. Microsoft, draw, uh, the stock dropped because the Justice Department is stepping up their antitrust activities, and Microsoft doesn't want to be broken up into smaller companies, but they're planning for it. You know, the future, just if, in case it comes down to that. They've got it all mapped out. There's going to be Microsoft operating systems. That'll be one company. Software applications, that'll be another company. A few other companies will be spun off. For example, Destroy Netscape Incorporated. That'll be that one. It's <laughs> another one. Uh, temps who are used to free pop limited. There's that one. <laughs> Helping billionaires dress themselves incorporated. And finally, I'm 32, got 20 million in the bank, three Porsches, two houses, and I hate myself and want to die company. <laughs> Those are just ones that are going to be spun off from Microsoft. Well, also, it's kind of a nostalgic week for those of us of a certain age. The National Guard was called out to put down a student rebellion this week. <laughs> to be young again, you know? This one happened at WSU in Pullman, and we sent a crew over there to see what's on those students' minds.